It's considered the most wonderful time of the year, but while some have an abundance during the holiday season, many do not. News 10's Lacey Clifton has more on how the Clay Community Center is rallying to take care of its own. It's a tragedy being treated in your own backyard. We kept remembering the story of the little boy last year who lost so much weight over Christmas break that it was visible and, and, and his teachers were alarmed for him. So to be able to get 14 days of food delivered to them is a blessing beyond belief. The Clay County Youth Food Delivery Program started for that very reason, with the big distribution in the coming days. For Christmas, we'll be delivering as of today, because it keeps changing, 344 children, and we just went to 140 families. What do you think about that ball, Henry? Would that work? But now, it isn't just meals, it's stockings, too. French Funeral Home is the hub of half the operation. Hands large and small work behind the scenes filling stockings, an idea sparked by Susie French from a similar program for countries overseas. We have a lot of needs here in our community, so I thought, well, we could maybe see how this would work to help our own community and then um, just see how it went. Now the call was put out just over a week ago and you're looking at more than 100 stockings that are all ready to be given out. Oh, it just um, makes you really glad you live in a small town. <laughs> I've been blessed by this community, and I always want to feel like I give something back. And these simple stockings stuffed with care will reach many. These kids, they're, they're getting their food for the Christmas break. I'd like for them to have a little something that's a, a joy as well. A little, just it may be something small, but it might be something that helps them uh, know that they're cared about. It's like it's a wonderful life yes. at the end when everybody comes to the house, you know, right. and everybody's bringing whatever they can. Yep. And sometimes it's little, and sometimes it's big. In Brazil, with photojournalist Marty Ledbetter, Lacey Clifton, News 10. The deadline to return the stockings to French's funeral home is December the 20th. Officials will distribute the stockings and food for winter break on the 22nd.